All right, this is a quick little video clip of a, a meter stick that's held on one end over on the right hand side and there's little brass weights that are placed on top and when the stick is released everything's going to start to fall and what I want you to notice is what happens to the brass weight that's here at two-thirds of a meter and notice what happens to the brass weights that are out further at 0.8 meters, 0.9 meters, and one meter from the very end. Each point on the stick since will will turn together, so every place on the stick has the same angular acceleration, but they will not have the same linear acceleration. And so what will happen is a point here is not going to accelerate um, down nearly as fast as a point that's on the, on the uh, outer edge. And so what you can do is find the rate of acceleration of different points on the stick um, using A equals R alpha. Well, so if we want to find how fast the end is accelerating, the end of the stick is going to accelerate with uh, L times 3G over 2L, um, which is going to give you an acceleration of 3 halves G, which is actually faster than G. So this end of the stick is going to go down with an acceleration of 3 halves g, um, where a point, say, in the middle of the stick, you'd put an L over 2 here, it would be only 3 fourths g here. Um, so there is a point where the acceleration would be exactly equal to g. And so just to see where that is, what you could do is you could say A equals, and then we could find the point where r times 3g over 2l um, is going to be equal to g. And what you can see is if you're at um, two-thirds the length of the stick, then, then these two expressions would be equal to each other. Um, so a equals g at r equals two-thirds of the length of the stick. And so that's why when we place the coin at two-thirds of the length of the stick, it stayed on the stick while these other coins that were further out actually got separated from the stick. So if you ever find yourself in an Indiana Jones type situation where you're uh, on, on the bridge and the, the, the bad guys uh, cut off one side of the bridge, well, you don't want to be on the, the, two, the one third of the bridge that's closest to the cut end um, because then the bridge is going to fall away from your feet way too fast for you to react uh, to grab the bridge. Um, so if you're on the, the two-thirds of the bridge that's closest to the fixed end, you'll have some hope of actually staying on the thing. Um, so notice this brass weight here, which is right at two-thirds of the length of the stick, um, notice how that stays attached as the, uh, as the stick falls, because that part of the stick is accelerating toward the ground at G upon release.